Why is my flashlight blinking? I don't like that. Hmm. Really don't like that. Yeah. That sound. Yeah. Does that mean something specific? I gotta choose something and stick with it. Heat vision or EMF. Obviously important if it's the one thing I can look at closer, and we've seen it before, of course. I'm going to take a picture of it, put it in my notes. Laundry and washroom. Let's not explore this yet. Oh, there's more of that symbol. Let's go to the science room. Oxford Health Authority. Date of birth, 20th of September, 1973. Status, orphan. Um, I have a lot of trouble reading cursive. Patrick something... Patrick something dead can... What, suffered broken legs? Something like that. Am I taking that with me? Yeah. one rune. Rune divination. What is this? Rune casting. The runes are ancient symbols used for centuries in divination and fortune telling. They are cast onto a surface where they form patterns, creating meaning and symbology for interpretation by the caster. 
A trained, experienced eye can spot the words and even sentences in what to others would look like a random scattering of stones. The software can determine possible translations, but it will be up to you to pinpoint definite messages. Rune casting. No. Can I do it at all if I wanted to do it right now? The mouse cursor shows up like I can click something here, but nothing happens. Huh. Don't think I'm meant to do that yet. First of April, <laughs> April 1st, April Fools, 1974. Mm, through game therapy, something, something, something. pH test solution. gonna be doing science. Acidic, alkaline. Got a bowl. And <laughs> this is where we do the science. Oh, this is like our stuff taken out for us to use. I see. I'm supposed to like put that down here? No. Let's give this place a once-over with some other tools. place, given how cursed it seems, surprisingly doesn't have much paranormal activity. Any voices? creepy voices in here either. Like, whispering, I mean. I don't know if that means there's really nothing here. Is 
Yeah, this place is pretty dead. Now that we've seen those runes, so... Hi, come in. Steve. Uh, yep, I'm here. I've just checked the upper classroom. You like? No, this is supposed to be a serious experiment. What's the problem now? It's set up like a bloody Halloween party. This is an open com, Ben. It's an experiment. Into what? How to fake a haunting for YouTube? No, it's to make things like they were in 1984. It's cheap. It's effective, and it's worked before. Fine, get on with it. I wonder if we can do anything new with this room now. No, just stare at it. Okay, um, let's go up to the attic. And listen to that frequency that we saw a while ago. And also, now that we have the object of death for Thomas Harding, maybe we should put that down? I thought we needed three objects, though. Not sure what all three were exactly. Object of death was one of them. Well, it's right here, so... The pen. Yep. And then... What, like, maybe their ID card? Ooh. Hmm. Save. Hello? Uh, I'm scared to turn. <laughs> hmm. Hmm. thing would be. Guess I can try everything. You want a tape? Is that important for you? Oh, nah, we're missing the third thing. But that's not actually why I came up here anyway. This. The station was like 80-something. I think it was that. Yeah, just check the notes. It is 89.3. Maybe the location of the radio does matter. I can't move this one, though. I'm just gonna groove to it for a bit, see if anything happens. Nothing on the radio. I did just discover this, though, a whole hotspot that I missed before. So this is like a whole Bunsen burner setup, although we don't have a beaker. I don't think you'd want to heat up this. <laughs> Yeah, we don't have all the parts to do science yet. So, what now? I guess I'll try to do the, do the piano thing? Let me just make sure I can actually play the piano.
Mm, again? First ones I think I can get. Not sure about the others. Touch it. error. <laughs> Don't know what it is I just accomplished, but I played a tune, heard some screams, and now there's that. Progress of some sort. Let's just start exploring. out whatever this is. It's not marked, or at least I can't look up to see the mark. Do we have the map on us, or is that just on the... Oh, we do have the map. Uh... Which perspective are we looking at this from? Opposite side of the runes. So it's this door, so we're just going into a hallway. Which then leads to the stoves, whatever that is, and then also the day room. Stop. 
still air? What's up with that? This is the day room. Oops. Day room. Although Shangri-La was surrounded by woodland and countryside, the children would have spent most days here in the day room. With a television, board games and regular meals, the children may have been content with what they had, oblivious to the world outside of the suggested Shangri-La utopia. Leave your worries behind as you play snakes and ladders instead. Occasionally, Operators have reported power to the television, stating images can be seen on the screen. This is impossible, so must be counted as a paranormal phenomena. Keep watching. Deeply cursed room. This is the truth. It's our second tape. Still no way to play them. Players of the world. that picture. More ghost stories? Find Steve's alternate Oxford Ghosts book. Ah, with notes in the margin. Ah, the burning boy. That's why that picture disturbed me. We've seen it before. Okay. True stories of odd happenings. Uh-huh. Dexter Books, Long Gone and Dead. The book that started it all. This could be the breakthrough the OPG has been waiting for. Why so much paranormal energy focused here? All evidence suggests there's something under the house. Find a copy of the book for Bear and Jen. Shangri-La in Operation... Oh, 1976. Theta Haining and Harry Borley, both deceased. Old-fashioned clothes about the pale boy. Ah, right. Jemima, the pale boy mentioned. Jemima was his pet canary. We only need five more to play, then the dark fall will go away. Five more? Jericho five? The ghosts can't leave the estate. They are trapped within the Harwood estate. Lady Isabella haunts the main hall, but she is most present in the greenhouse. Oh. <laughs> I knew she wasn't real, just drifting backwards through the doors. Send Ben, he's the charmer. There's a link here to roses. Isabella may be drawn to them, but which ones? Set up a locked off camera in this room. Film a game board, see if we can't get him to play a game. Right, they... The fire started when the board game... When they were playing a board game. <laughs> Safe to play, or does he play tricks? Thomas Harding, look up the name. Already done. 
Thomas Harding, victim number two, stabbed himself in the ears with his ink pen. Try and find a similar pen. Conduct a trigger object experiment. Lost lovers. No one missed them. Easy targets. Old passage. Where did they go? Another explanation. Echoes. Part of the dark fall effect. And then the darkling. Creatures. Something under the house. Servants of the dark fall. They seek new souls to trick. They use your memories, your nostalgia to do it. John Draker, council road worker, said he heard the shouts of a man in distress. It's one of the Jericho Five. Several of Oxford's finest did very well after 1749. Monuments, recognition, fancy halls. What kind of offer did Harwood put to his fellow brothers? Steal someone's hope? Their future? No digital. Stick to analog. It's way too easy for Bear to read my online stuff and see my search history. He's a pain in the ass, but I like him. Jen too. She's been fun on the adventure. Now to the end. Just need to get past that door. It's not like it's stuck. It's the kid. The greedy guts from 1983. Ollie Tanner. I'm going to try a vigil. See if I can't stir things up a little. What are we clicking on? That's weird. Clicking on the things in the suitcase brings it up. It's really strange. What is that? I have no idea what that is. I can use stuff here. Don't think there's anything I'd want to use. No, it's not airing out anymore. Whole fireplace is really hot. Yeah. Yeah, I think that sound cue means something. That yeah. Not sure what exactly, just something paranormal. play if I want it to. Doesn't seem like it. Maybe this thing's for playing. I don't know what it is. unlocked then. <laughs> 
Leaving the TV for last, don't worry. that we heard about when we tried in the attic. Okay, TV time, I think. Almost. Just old magazines. He's really hot. Yet, I can't do anything with it. What's that in the wall that I see on this thing? I don't see it outside of this tool. Nah. does that when I touch it? It's alright. Just gonna make a save. So this is the door they mentioned in the notes somewhere that they wanted to get inside, but the boy won't let them. I totally recorded something. What bling did I just hear? How's the weather? 13 degrees, air quality good. Oh, it was bad before. You gotta click on the thing, I see. Mm. 
Jesus, it says, play me or get burnt. Anything's gonna happen there. Oh, is that like a pile of ripped up paper? Can I do something with that? <laughs> what can I possibly do with that if I can't just take it? I don't know. Yeah, I don't think I'm gonna be able to do anything with them until I play them, and I can't seem to play them right now. I'm not exactly sure why. Am I missing? I don't actually know how to play snakes and ladders. But maybe I need another dice? are always bad news. Thankfully this one isn't very reflective. We can hear the picture. Just a jumble of words coming out. The sea provides for this town. He must have died. Be careful what you go looking for. It's a separate focal zone for those two different people. You can like look at different spots. I guess it's not always a person, just spots of interest. I don't think it matters. Wasn't that facing the other way? What the fuck? I can't tell if that's supposed to be creepy or if it's just because that's the image they have and it's obviously a 2D cutout. They only had its front, <laughs> maybe, I don't know. that's good for now so i hope you've enjoyed so far and when we return we are going to go check out the laundry and washroom